today I'm going to be decorating this um, top hat. I bought it when I went to the steampunk fair in um, Morecambe in October and um, I've just been waiting on a few things to arrive and um, I thought today would be a fabulous day for me to decorate it. Uh, first of all I have also bought got some of these goggles as well and I've got some peacock feathers from Gone Artsy along with this brown trim which I'm going to add around the the edge of the um, hat and I've also made uh, this bow with organza it's an organza scarf so that is going to sit at the back so um, let's make a start so first thing I want to do is start adding this trim round it's not going to go all the way round and meet here but that's fine because the uh, the bow will cover it so first off let's take this tape off which is stuck on I love this trim from um, Gone Art see unfortunately the store on Gone, uh, Gone Art see store is going to be closing on the 20th I think of December and she's got some really good deals on at the moment so if you fancy having a pop across I'll put the link and uh, just please pop across and I always like to use my lighter just to make sure that uh, it doesn't fray so I'll do that at both ends just trim that down a bit and trim it and my heat gun is all nicely set so let's make a start just take your time and work your way around suppose because I'm left-handed I, I work back to front to some of you ladies out there and gents who are not <laughs> left-handed it's looking quite nice I'll get rid of that later a trick to getting rid of the um, the excess is just gently waft your heat gun over it and it will come away so I'm not too bothered because I can do that right at the end making sure obviously you don't burn your hat I've been dying to do this but I've been waiting for me peacock feathers to come from Deb and um, so I was Quite, uh, as soon as they arrived I um, thought right and obviously finding a day to do it good I couldn't believe it when I um, was at the fair and they had this um, purple top and those of you who know me very well know that purple is my favorite favorite color so 
I had to buy it it was saying I bought the outfit as well so I, I just need a few bits and then my outfits complete then I want a nice uh, black blouse I've got the corset and the skirt the crinoline skirt so um, hopefully next year I'm going to be doing a couple of the steam thing steampunk fairs but we'll see see what happens a laborious job but needs to be done and I will cut the video down uh, this part down a bit because it's repetitive and you don't want to sit here watching me do this all the time so I will see you at the end when it's done okay so there is the trim complete where it didn't meet at the back I've um, added a, a little cog which will show nicely when when the ribbon so next job I want to do is add my goggles and I'm just going to place that round there we are so there's my goggles all in place and I want to have something in the front here and when I was at the um, the steampunk fair I picked up this owl um, so I'm going to place him on the front there As you can see looking really looks nice now to decorate the side and I think I'm going to I think I might use a couple of the fe of the feathers I want them going down there and I've got to uh, just show you I've got an assortment of Cameo is going to be going into the centre of my bow, which I'm going to leave till the end. And I've got an assortment of different sized cogs. And I've got this uh, fabulous key as well, which has got cogs all around it as well. So I'm going to use that to decorate too. So uh, let's get to it. I'm not sure how. So I'll just stick my feather in there like that. I think I'll have the two of them. Just trim off some of this. I'll trim off some of this as well. There we are, and that can go down the side there. I'm just going to add a bit of, um, oops, add some hot glue to it. Add 
the next one as well. So I've got a couple. playing nicely. I'll have this one shorter I think. like that. Can you see? So across the um, where the peacock feather joins I'm going to add my key across it. So I just need to bend it a bit just so it sits nicely. Here we are. Can you see? And now I'm just going to decorate around that after I've sorted, got rid of all this bump. And now I've got all these. I don't want the silver. I like to stay with the um, the colours. So I'll kind of film with the bronzy ones. Just add them. Dotted around the key. Nice dimensional ones. Do you like steampunk? I do, I love it. Let your imagination run wild.
so I've done that can you see so now just to finish off I'm going to add my organza bow at the back there I'm going to add it so that this trails down so I've got a nice trail at the back the bow and last but not least what I'm going to add is this really pretty <coughs> cameo from Gone Artsy And there we have it, my steampunk hat with the peacock feathers and the keys and the cogs and the trail, train at the bottom. I will take a couple of um, still photos at the end, um, which will be at the end of the video. And... Um, I do hope you've enjoyed this uh, quick video of me decorating. I'll give you a thumb, please leave a thumbs up, subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you so much for watching today. Until next time, bye bye.